This is Linda Sherman, at Linda Sherman on Twitter, and I'm here with Evan Solomon, at Evan Solomon on Twitter. Thank you so much for being with us here today, Evan. Sure, thanks for having me. I am, as everyone knows, a big WordPress fan, and my company, Courage Group, builds WordPress sites, so I have a, a, a bit of a prejudice towards it, but I also think it's scientifically proven that it's the best platform on the universe. And we're here in front of the WordPress Happiness Bar at Blog World, and at major conferences you will find the Happiness Bar because WordPress is about really helping the community and the community helps each other and it's, it's just a wonderful organization and Evan is a very important person at WordPress and so I wanted him to help me explain to you why WordPress is the platform of choice for your next website. Sure, so there's a lot of great things about it. Um, the ones that come up most often that I happen to like the most are really around customization. So there's a ton of great developers out there who have built themes and plugins for WordPress and basically what that lets you do is make your site look and act like whatever you might want. Um, so really it's, WordPress has grown so much that almost anything you could think of that you wanted to do, there's someone that's done something like that and building on that community development makes it a lot of fun to use. Great. and. Um, one of one of the things that I think is very important is is that a lot of the clients that we work have come from websites that they got built like five ten years ago and every time they want to make a change they have to go back to the developer and maybe the developer has moved to another country and they're disappeared and with WordPress you can always hand off the the site and it's so easy for anybody to be able to pick it up and and make changes and and even the the the, the owner themselves can go in and put something new in a widget or or move things around themselves yeah i mean one of the great things is that it sort of hands the power back to who's whomever site it might be whereas you look at sites that were being built 10 years ago and if you wanted to change your email address or the title or something you had to call a developer and you had no idea how to do it and it was sort of locked out of your control and it's your site so it should never really be out of your control and the great thing about WordPress is it makes it so easy we hear people in companies and who have client work talk about like oh finally I can let these other people actually edit stuff so every time they want to change the title of a form I don't get a call at 3 in the morning and, and you know it's it's a much better way to to run your what usually ends up being your communication with the world sort of is your website absolutely do, do you have anything to say about why they should have a website at all why you should have a website at all? Um, that's an interesting question. I can't imagine taking a business seriously that didn't have some presence on the web. Um, I can't imagine finding a business who didn't have some presence on the web, but once I did find them, if you don't have a website, it's, I don't know, I get suspicious, I guess. Like, it seems very strange not to. Um, it's like, why not have a phone number? Well, another thing is these days a lot of people are in transition and even individuals should have web websites to represent themselves, I think. Yeah, absolutely. I think you should own your identity on the web, um, whether that's in the form of a blog or photos or just a resume or whatever it might be. You should have some place you can point to on the web and say, that's me. Um, it's so important. I don't know why you wouldn't do that. Great. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your being with us today, Evan. Thanks a lot.